Hooray! Three cheers for Andrew Brown. Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> Amazing. Um, sort of mind blowing, really. Um, not, I just imagine sort of just coming home, sort of tired off the plane and things like that. But it's been really nice to see everyone come out. Um, so sort of my mum had told me that sort of people in the area were sort of interested and had been sort of following and things. It's fantastic to see that. Actually, they were <laughs> that sort of thing. It's really nice, really nice. We had some really tough sort of weather conditions, and that had a knock on on some of the bits of kit. And um, even in terms of, I suppose it's, there's a lot of worrying that goes on these things. You always worry about something that's going to break. You're spending a lot of time thinking about how you'd fix things. And we had a couple of things that broke, and uh, you know, battery went, um, which was very frustrating. I had a really low moment, around with 800 miles to go. Um, I think. It felt almost like the end was getting in sight, but actually that's still a really long way to row. Um, and I don't, I don't think I ever felt like I oh, sort of wanted to give up. There's a couple of times where I felt really quite scared, um, and I wasn't sure whether I was sort of still racing or just sort of trying to sort of survive. Um, but um, yeah, no, that was that was probably the, some of the trickiest times. There was a lot of relief. Um, I was quite pleased, and especially when I sort of first got onto land, I was really quite pleased. But it was all. I think I was really, really tired, and I didn't quite feel like it was sort of me that arrived. That just sort of looking back at some of the, the pictures and things, uh, you know, that's how I sort of remember it, um, not from the actual experience itself. I don't know if it was. I don't think it's still quite settled in, um, but um, yeah, I'm sort of quite, quite relieved about it, and um, yeah, just feels quite nice.